Howdy, I'm Brian. I'm Just. Here with the all-new RAV4 Hybrid and Discovery VR in the middle of San Antonio, Texas, to check out the legendary Alamo. Wow. So iconic, so much history right here in this spot. Wait, like, this exact spot? This oh. allegedly is the line in the sand drawn by William Barrett Travis saying, all men prepared to give your lives, step over the line like I'm doing right now. Oh, so See, am I'm I. brave. Good, yeah. Dude, there's so much history here. I cannot wait to dive in. You ready, boss? Let's go. Let's do this. So we all know we're supposed to remember the Alamo, but none of us can remember what we're supposed to remember about the Alamo. So we got an expert, Dr. Bruce Winders, curator and historian. Thanks so much for joining us, man. Good morning. Good to be here. What makes the Battle of the Alamo so iconic? It's one of those last stand scenarios. It's, it's very desperate. All the defenders in the end are, are killed, but it, it, it just resonates with people around the world. So this is at the height of the Texas Revolution, right? Texas has declared independence. The Texas uh, revolutionaries have captured this. Uh, you said, what, December of 1835? That's right. A few months later, Santa Ana comes back with a, a huge army of, of thousands. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and what is it like in the days leading up to it? I mean, do they know that there's impending slaughter or, or is, is the mood desperate or do they feel like they're gonna win? What we know is that uh, they're asking for help. William Bear Travis, the commander's sending out letters saying, come help us. But uh, those the same letters are saying, if you don't come, we're prepared to stay here and, and die if we have to because we believe it's important for us to defend San Antonio. Wow. I have always, in my head, imagined the Alamo as kind of this place away from other things, and yet coming into the heart of San Antonio, you kind of realize that it is very much a part of this city. How built up was San Antonio at the point that that battle happened? Well, you're right. This old mission is the heart of the city, and it's here first. It's sort of the seed from which San Antonio grows. Just so everybody can can get a sense here, we have this as the entrance. Mm -hmm. We go as as far as uh, you know the, the church and and everything inside of there. That's one side, and it goes as far down as the end of that block. And you add two hundred people to defend that, while two thousand are outside attacking from all angles. And it's dark. And, and it's, it's dark. dark. Of course it is. <laughs> That is amazing. I had never had a proper sense of scale about how big this battle was until now. Well, that's that's that aha moment that yeah. many people have that I didn't realize. And that's why you've got to come here. Yeah. So what was the biggest surprise from the Alamo? Uh, just how big it was that me and 199 other people would have to defend all this yeah, the from, scale is huge. Yeah, 2,000, that's crazy. Yeah, and for me, that moment when you look down and see the line in the sand and realize this is where the people made their decision to stand and fight, total goosebumps, man. It's something I'm always going to remember. I see what you did there. 